Hi everyone and welcome to this tutorial on what I'm calling the hair slide bun. Now before I start I just have to clarify what a hair slide is um, with regard to this tutorial. This, if you were to look it up on the internet, would be classed as a hair slide. Um, it's technically, it's called a barrette and you just sort of squeeze like that and it pops open. Now, although this is a hair slide, it's not appropriate for this style because it's so narrow that it's just going to get lost in your hair, um, especially if you've got long hair like me. It might work if your hair is shorter or thinner, but if you've got hair as long as mine, don't, don't use it. Um, what I'm going to be using instead is this hair slide. Um, this is a hair slide that I picked up in Ireland and it's got a hair stick which pulls out like that and um, that's the reverse and it goes through like that and it'll only go through one way or the other um, which is a bit irritating because if I want my knot that way up I have to put the slide in from right to left because if I try and put it in from left to right, it jams, it won't go through. So it's got to be that way if I want to go right to left, or that way, left to right. Um, this is a, another variation, this is a leather one. Um, this probably came from Claire's Accessories actually. I think this one, because it's more flexible, it's, it's not made of metal, um, I could put the uh, stick through either way. Um, and that's fine. This is, uh, this is very Captain Janeway. For those of you who are Voyager fans, um, sort of season three of Voyager, Janeway wore these to jazz up her ponytails quite a lot. Another example is this, and it's, it's more like a flexiate, to be honest, I think, although I've never actually used a flexiate, in that the stick doesn't come out all the way. It remains attached. Um, so, for the purpose of the tutorial, I'm going to use my Irish one ah, and um, show you how to create this bun. Keep watching. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is to detangle as always and smooth your hair back into a ponytail in the centre of your head. Um, it's got to be in the middle because um, the hair is going to go around the hair slide. It's sort of a variation on the Chinese bun. Um, so. Pull that up, nice and central, and tie it off into a ponytail. Okay, part two, take your hair stick and make sure that you know which way through the, the rod will go without sticking. Put this bit over the ponytail slide the stick through one side, slide the stick under the band of the ponytail and through the other side like that. And you might want to pull it down a little bit so the design can be seen from the back of your head. Now you can just wear your hair slide like this, it's a perfectly acceptable way of doing it. But we are going to bun it, and this is where the Chinese bun influence comes in. Split your ponytail into two pieces and wrap them around the hair slide. This is why it's got to be a big hair slide, because what you're going to do is try and pull it so it's underneath the design of the hair slide. Once you've got all your hair in there, you can adjust the slide and now we just need to pin the ends down. So uh, get your trusty pot of hair grips. Um, I'm going to use a spin pin just for the bottom and I'm going to twist that all the way up to top. That will just add a bit of security. 
and then I'm just going to use my ordinary hair grips to pin down any loose ends, any stray bits that are sticking out um, and while I'm at it I'll, uh, I'll clip down my little flyaways as well. Okay, so I've got two hair grips in the bottom, two in the top, and one at the front here just to tame my flyaways. And that is it. That is your hair slide bun. And I think it's a really nice way of showing off your hair accessory. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. I shall add a couple of pictures of the other hair slides to uh, sort of show how they look. Um, and as I say, you should be able to do this with a flex ear as well. If it worked for you, let me know, show me pictures, you know where to find me. Cheerio. This is the style with an average narrow barrette. This is what it looks like. And as you can see, although it does work, because the barrette is so narrow, the detail of it is quite lost in all my hair. Uh, I think if you've got hair that's shorter or thinner than mine, it'll work a treat.